have someone in our audience who is our neighbor. She's from Naperville, and guess what? She has shed, get this, 203 pounds and wow. was recently featured in People Magazine's cover story on those who sliced their weight literally in half. Today, she's here to talk about her weight loss and her transformation, so please welcome Marge Lees. Hi, Marge. Hi. <laughs> 103 pounds. What, Marge, at what point did you realize, I got to lose some weight? Well, you know what? My aha moment was I was at my cousin's anniversary party, and I was dancing with everybody else and having a great time, and I collapsed from heat exhaustion. And the next day I knew I couldn't do this anymore. I couldn't have my kids see me that way. I couldn't right. have my family see me that way. So... I decided to make a lifestyle change. And March, how did you do it? Did you do it with diet and exercise? Um, I did it. I, when I woke up in the morning, I decided I'm going to go out and buy a case of Slim Fast, and I'm going to join a gym, and I'm going to change my life. And I made a promise to myself to do that. And as long as you make that promise and keep that promise to yourself, you can do that, and you have to. Marge, you know what I find interesting? Do you mind me asking how old you are? I am 52 years old and a grandmother of the most beautiful little grandson you would ever imagine around. Here's, that's so wonderful because here's where I'm going. A lot of times people, women tend to think, or men, the older I get, my metabolism slows down, that it's too late. And I mean, what would be your message to someone about it being, oh, well, it's too late. I'm just going to be stuck like this for the rest of my life. You know what, you can't do that. You can always change your life because you're the only one that can control your health and you need to make that promise to yourself and keep it. And it's an everyday lifestyle change. How long have you kept it off? I've kept it off eight years now. Eight years. So you're still eating right and exercising. Is that what you're still doing? Pardon me? You're still just eating right and exercising yes, right now? Yes, yes. I just cut out the junk. I cut out the pop. I drink a lot of water and I exercise daily at least two hours a day. Two wow. hours a day? Yeah. I work at a great gym, uh, Midtown Athletic Club in Willowbrook, and I'm able to go out and exercise in the morning. Okay. And I'm able to motivate people. I see people losing their motivation when I look out my office and I keep with me what I call my fat pictures because I go out and I talk to people on treadmills and they say well what do you know about this mm. and I show them my pictures and I explain to them that I do know and anybody and everybody can do it as long as they stick to it right and Marge you have that armband on explain what that does yes I also have this is a body media armband and what this does is it calculates everything I do during the day. It will calculate all the calories I'm burning, all my vigorous activity, my moderate activity, your sleep patterns, it does everything for you. So you can plug it into your computer at night and I know if, hey, I hit all my goals that day or, or I, I slacked off, I really need yes. to do better tomorrow. It's, it's wonderful. It's a great thing. Well, you know, our team around here, we've got a couple of teams in the office that are really trying to lose weight and really stick with it. So give us the last little bit of encouraging words. Stick to it and just do what you set your mind out to do. It's not willpower anymore. It's want power. All, All right. right. March, thank you so much. Everyone here will yeah. be able to stay on track as well because you all are all getting the armband. Yeah. for joining us who are definitely an inspiration to all of those wanting to drop the pounds.